Hey guys, it's Rick from Tackle Village back with another fly tying video. Um, this time we're tying a really, really simple fly, um, the stick caddis. Uh, it's a bit of a different stick caddis. This one uses peacock curl and a um, yellow transparent bead, a um, bit different to the, the usual one um, some people tie. Anyway, so what we're going to do, we previously tied this pro fly, I've had lots of problems with this bead sort of sliding up and down or even sliding off. Um, Oh, sorry, hook to start off with. We're using a TMC uh, 100 hook um, in a size 12. So what we're going to do is just put a bit of this Gulf um, fly tying resin, UV activated resin. That's, that's the stuff here. Um, really, really good. So what we're going to do is put a dob of that up near the eye. I'm trying not to put too much on. Right, that's got that. Then we slide up the bead. To where we want it. Now the resin's activated by uh, this torch. Give it a shine with the torch for a few seconds. That should activate our resin and keep that um, bead locked in place. Oops, got to give it a bit more time. Okay, that's got it. That's got that in place. Now this is a really, really simple pattern, so we won't take too long. I just uh, wrap a basic thread base, go down to the bend of the hook. Doesn't matter if it's a bit rough. Um, just going for speed and simplicity here. Okay, that's in, tied that in. Now what we wanna do is get two to three strands of um, peacock curl. This curl I've got is a little bit weedy so I'm gonna use three strands instead of two because uh, I think that'll make it for a better fly okay so I'm just trim off the butts where I uh, attached it or oh, sorry where I ripped it off the feather I'm gonna tie that down okay that's tied down now I'm gonna take the thread back to that where I anchored the hurl and apologies if I knock the camera doing this, it's a little bit tricky. Then we just use the um, hurl, the three strands of hurl, we wrap it a few times around the tying thread just to make a kind of rope out of the hurl, um, which will create the effect we want as we wrap forward down the, shank of the hook, down the shaft of the hook. Okay, so that's got that. Now we're going to wrap one, two, and just wrap our way up with this hurl rope. Keep going. Still going, still going till we get to the back of the bead. Right, now we're just going to pull these strands forward and a bit messy there, sorry about that. Tie these strands forward and anchor the fly, that's got it. Right, now we can trim these off. Beautiful. All we do is to finish is whip finish one two three over the head over the bead head cut off the thread and there we are there's our stick caddis nice slow stinking sinking stick caddis to uh, full lake trout a really nice fly anyway if you like this um, instructional video hit like uh, subscribe to our channel and we'll keep more of these videos coming um, teaching you a little bit about some of the flies we tie